this is the Singer 301 sewing machine. It has a die cast aluminum body. It was a new innovation created by the Singer Sewing Machine Company to make a different style of sewing machine for the new century. They even redesigned the way they cast the aluminum for the body to make it easier to manufacture. It's supposed to represent a new century and to provide a faster sewing machine. The needle bar here, as you see, is now tilted nine degrees. And they did that so that you could see your st stitches easier in the front. And the other change is you didn't have to thread your needle left or right you threaded the needle from the front to back, which is also a different change. They redesigned this whole body style. And this one that I'm showcasing here is a long bed. They have two types. You have a short bed and a long bed singer, 301. And I changed the little wheel. The wheel is pink <laughs> for the bobbin winder. Just a little difference. And this one was uh, it just has one plug. Some come with two plugs. You could for the foot pedal control and the power. The other change was everything is internal. The motor, everything's internal and concealed, which was better for high school, high schools that use them and teachers that use them. And it really is a very durable machine. And you can see the drop feed system here. That's the big black knob. And there's the bobbin. It does use the same bobbin as the featherweight, but this machine is not a featherweight. It has been totally redesigned. It is a very nice lock stitch sewing machine. That's the drop feed. So if you're a quilter, you can drop your foot and quilt, do free motion quiltings with this machine easier. Just to give you an example, the 221, the featherweight can do about, uh, let's see, 600 to 800 stitches, but this machine can do 1600 stitches. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. And I'll see you next time. Bye for now.